Your touch so soft Not looking for no, no, no Heaven or gold Cause I got you I got you Don't wanna show Back at the end, and I'm going to be talking about Sims 4 pregnant with 100 babies. First off, I'm going to summarise the story because even though that a lot of people get it, there are always going to be people that don't. And there are always comments saying, I didn't get this. I don't understand it. So yeah, to go over it very quickly, it's about a girl called Helga. She has a condition that the doctors can't quite figure out, but it has something to do with being pregnant. After being told to wait by the doctor, she storms out because she's told that she's gonna go in for like further testing. And she goes to a club and she has a one night stand with a guy called Dustin, who looks surprisingly similar to Justin. But she instantly feels unwell the next morning and after it's explained to her by the doctor that she's pregnant, they're all very confused <laughs> because she's only known Dustin one night and well, we can't really imagine how he's feeling. So Dustin promises to help her when it comes to the baby, but to be honest, he was only expecting one child, never mind a hundred. So when it comes to her being in labour and her having a hundred babies, let's just say that Dustin, who, aka maybe Justin, is just, he's not prepared for it. He's not prepared for that kind of commitment, so he runs and he's just frightened. But he does return and he takes on fatherhood and they become a real team in the end. So yeah, it's supposed to be a bit of like team team building, coming together, you know, some like character progression in there. And that's where the story ends when they get engaged. So it was not supposed to be a realistic story. <laughs> um, I do not think that it is possible for anybody to have a hundred babies and it's not even possible for a sim to. I had to fake a lot of this. A lot of it was like angles and um, even like on a lot of the shots, it was like 40 or 50 sims at max and a lot of the others were like um, fake displays of sims which didn't really look that realistic but it was like the best that I could find um, and I don't really create that much custom content myself so I would no way be able to make like fake custom content kids but yeah if you are a custom content maker then drop me an email because I'd love that in the future but it really was just for entertainment it was just a story the best thing about it is that it enables you to be as creative as you want to be and a lot of my stories you can't actually have in The Sims 4. So yeah, I'm just hoping that something like this and like future stories will bring people a bit of entertainment and a bit of, oh, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> um, that's what I want. I just want that like element of surprise. My laptop crashed, I'm gonna say 40, 50 times <laughs> in the making of this. It crashed on the plane and then ran out of battery because it was too powerful and it had two hours of charging. So yeah, this is like how much stress I put my laptop under whilst making this. So I really hope that you're all going to enjoy it. Many of the other things that were shown were made possible by using mods and just random pieces of custom content. There were loads of easter eggs in here as well so let me know if you spotted any of them because that's always interesting to see what you've spotted in the comments a lot of the time a whole story 
just stems from just a passing comment of someone saying hey could you do the 100 baby challenge or like hey could you try this and just from that like i'll get a whole different idea <laughs> So that's probably what's happened here. Someone's probably suggested that I do the 100 baby challenge and I thought, no, I'm not gonna do that because I don't like let's plays or challenges really, but I could create a story. You can follow me on Twitter and Instagram, HatsyYT. I'll leave it in the description below. I usually post on my story and I'll sometimes post pictures of like future things coming up. Thanks for watching and I'll speak to you all soon.